So let me explain to you how I got this fish. Okay, so I'm in, I'm in a tournament right now, all right? Fishing wrong, I got a black and blue jig with a watermelon red flake uh, little craw on the back. And I'm flipping it. I pull up to this nice set of looking boathouses. You got these nice boathouses, standard boathouses. There's three of them. They're all in separate spots. And they each got, you know, the garage, the classic garage door over the front. You know what I'm saying? These are some good looking boathouses. We don't usually have a lot of those here on Conroe. So I'm figuring, hey, something a little different. Let's go flip it, you know? So I go up there. I get my jig. Flip it. Really, that run down. Fishing, fishing. Don't feel that classic thumb. You know what I'm saying, man? Everybody feels it. You know, that classic jig bite. Real down. Set the hook on him. My rod just loads up. And I'm, my first initial thought is, I'm snagged. Dang it, man. I'm snagged. Gonna have to get this jig back, you know? This is my last one. And then my line starts moving. I'm like, oh, yeah, no, that's a fish. I roll down. I'm pulling on. I'm like, that's a big fish. My first initial thought, or my second initial thought is, this is a big bass. So I'm calling my partner, come here, get the net, man. We gotta net this fish, because we're in a tournament, man. I don't think it's a big old bass. And I'm fishing along, I'm pulling it. I'm like, he's not giving me anything. Usually, usually, you know, you give some, but he's not giving me any. And usually with these big old bass, what they love to do is they love to jump, you know. Oh, this is a I hate it when they jump, man. It's so cool that they jump, but they always spit it out. They always seem to spit it out. You know, you gotta keep them from jumping, you know, because they're gonna spit it out. And I'm waiting for them to jump, you know, because I'm expecting them to jump, you right. And he's not jumping. He's not jumping. I'm fishing along, fishing along. He's not jumping. I'm like, uh oh. You know, wait, wait. I'm like, oh, hold on, hold on. This is a little weird. He's not jumping. You know, usually they jump. Real down. I'm like, okay, well, what is this? And then he starts pulling drag. And I, this is, I got a uh, Origin TX. I think it's got, it's got some pretty, it's, it's just a saltwater reel pretty much. It could, this is meant for inshore, you know. So it's got, I got my drag synced all the way down. And this sucker's pulling drag. And I'm like, eh, I don't think this is a bass anymore. And I'm fishing along. And then all of a sudden he comes up to the surface. I finally kind of get him up to the surface. He goes, with his giant tail, flashes it. And I'm like, oh, there's a big old catfish. And I'm thinking it's a blue cat because I've caught blue, big blue cat before and I couldn't really see it. All I could see was a tail. And I was like, I knew it was a big old catfish. Real down, finally got him in. Took two of us, had to pull him up in the net. And uh, the rest is history. So check out this video. 36, we'll count 36. Oh my goodness. Woo. All right, look at this. Keep the video going, look at this. I just want to show them this. Look at this, come on here. Yeah, let's get him. I have this net. I can probably grab the back of it. Yeah, grab him. Look what I caught him on. Look what I caught him on. Come look at this. Let's get these. All the way. All right. Look at this. I caught him on a jig, man. <laughs> Thought he was a giant bass. 